This episode is brought to you by GoDaddy.com. Hey, we need some competition. Go out and create your own video show, spirit review blog. Just get your domain at GoDaddy.com. Use code EDDR3 and your .com domains will be $7.49. Welcome to Gotham Man Cocktails. I'm your host, Eric Stormer. Today we're creating the You're a Mean One, Mr. Grinch, with my co host, Doug Peterson. Howdy. I can say your last name, right? Sure. Okay. Because <laughs> I haven't yet. That's okay. I'm really hot with this app. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's the lights. It's the lights. So, this recipe was not submitted by, but was created by. No, wait. The song was created by Thurl. 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 Can you Thorol read Ravencroft. That? No, okay. I'm reading the teleprompter. That he calls it a teleprompter. Oh, nice. You didn't notice that big white thing there? It's been a long day. I know. Um, so, while th- there was a one company who decided they're going to make a bunch of take a bunch of Christmas songs and make recipes, which is where we came up with the last recipe, which was called. I saw mommy uh, kissing Santa Claus. Yes. So what we decided Perfect. to do is another one. Okay. Another long name with a comma in it. Yeah. This recipe is going to have lucent absinthe. Absinthe. Big fan of absinthe. Uh, are we actually going to float it? No. Over the. Uh-uh. No, not float it, but do it with the sugar cubes and the. No. Okay. Loosh. Loosh it. No, we're Luge not going to loosh it. Okay. Um, and uh, also, a fresh bottle of Midori. Midori. I, if you've noticed, I've got a few things and I don't know where my Midori went. So I might have even either drank it. The fans would know because they usually know when I go through a bottle. It. Or I lost it. <laughs> Back there. Yeah, it's not really lost, lost. <laughs> Someday <laughs> I could find it. So if I, I don't find see anything it, green though, I know yeah. I looked for everywhere. Yeah. And over there, the, green. there's a couple things. Yeah, but oh. one's absinthe and one's yeah. There's ag- like the absinthe agua. and there's the agua, which is what this they sent me this too. This is a cool device. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a one ounce of absinthe. We're gonna do an ounce and a half of Midori, so it's gonna be sweet. Okay. It's gonna go in a little ball glass. It's all dirty. That's okay. Um, why it, is it dirty? I don't know. <laughs> That's weird. You it was your lipstick. It? My lipstick. I don't know what's on there, but we'll worry about that. Who cares? People who make drinks from us know we're calling it cocktails. I, I, last week I blended something that had a dog hair in it, so I got that out too. So uh, things happen. <laughs> um, splash of ginger ale. Was it one of those? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I saw it. <laughs> no, it was a really long dog hair. <laughs> yeah. So an ounce and a half of absinthe, an ounce, no, an ounce, of absinthe, ounce and a half of Midori melon liqueur, splash of ginger ale, two to three limes. So I'm going to do two to three limes right here. Do it. Ready? Yep. Think it's going to work? I hope so. Ready? Yes. <laughs> oh. It squirted. <laughs> Correction, effervescent. <laughs> it does not mean the squirty part. No. It should bubble. Unless that's like lime Smell that? bubbling. Yes, it's lime. It's awesome, right? So we're going to muddle. I'm using this muddler. Sorry, I almost stabbed you. You're not going to use the other one? What, the Zante one? Yeah. I was going to use the Zante one. That one looks one. dirtier. It do- yes. <laughs> I have a couple of these. No, I was going to use the Zante one. However, everybody's been asking for these. Because last week, I said I'm going to give away a bunch of stuff. And people keep saying, I want this, I want that. The lanyard, which is around here. I just moved everything. Since you're here, there's usually Christmas stuff here. Okay. Um, I will be giving that out. I just, I'm still waiting to get some stuff in. So, I'm not using that because I want to give it to a fan because they want it. And I'm just going to use... This one. Oh, Do it. You're not going to keep one for yourself. No. This is actually a company, too. I just don't know what this is. Uh, Yamaka. I have no idea. So we're going to muddle it. <laughs> I don't think it's so you, can, you can muddle it in your clean or dirty glass. But what I'm going to do, since it's going to be shaken a couple times and then poured back in, you're going to take the two to three limes. I'm going to use three because three limes is better than two. We're going to muddle the limes, right? Muddle the two to three limes. Do it. Oh, yeah. Oh. Just with itself? Oh. With itself. I know. Is See, I was thinking the same muddle? thing as like you muddle use something that kind of yeah. needs to be. Like sugar. Yeah. Then you add ice. Yeah, I normally use the sugar to kind of bring out some of the the stuff. The stuff being. Yeah. The flavors. Yeah. But they said the in the recipe, muddle the limes. Then you're going to add the stuff. Okay. We're going to do an ounce and a half of Midori. You ever, you've had Midori, right? Uh-huh. Okay, so the, there's no there's no surprises here. There's no surprise here. here. All right. Wow. How'd you know what to say? Because you were saying He's this psycho. is this is a verde absent. Mm-hmm. So it's gonna it would normally would turn it's a green. Verde absent. Yeah, which is green, I think, in French. All right. Or you know Spanish. French or Spanish? That would be Spanish. Yeah. Is it? That could be French. Too. We need to keep her. <laughs> 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 like instant instant corrections. 
I and I because it saves me from getting. I get all those corrections usually on YouTube because people are like, no, you're an idiot. It's this. <laughs> <laughs> Can you smell that? Yes. All right, we're gonna top it with the ginger ale, but we're gonna do that later. Okay. Because now, before shaking, would create a mess. We're gonna shake it. Okay. Do I have all my ingredients in here? I got yes. my limes. Yep. Look. Absinthe. Everything is going in this glass. Wow. Even the limes. Huh? Everything. Even the limes. limes, all. Right there. You know, you could make this like around Halloween and call it the. Um... Green? Goblin? No. No. Green Goblin, we did that one. No. <laughs> the Slimer. Uh, yeah. yeah. Slimer would work. The Slimer? Yeah, like the, the Slimer. slimer. Yeah. The article in the front makes it all work. Or. Well. If you're doing a TV show, uh, um, name one so you can name it the You Can't Do That on Television. The slime? Yeah. The I Don't Know? Yeah, I don't, I don't know what's on top of there. I'm just going to... Oh, you know what that is? The lime... The, the, the pieces. Yeah, the lime piece. It's nice. kind of weird looking. Um, there you go. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. It's green. It's dark green. It, you could see some of the lime floating around inside. I can smell it from a while, from far yeah. away. What does that smell like? Absinthe. It does. Yeah. It's the, uh, I guess the anise. Yeah. Anise, anise, whatever you call it. Anise. Let's go with anise. Anise? <laughs> it's that <laughs> anise smell that it has. Mmm, <laughs> <Well>, refreshing. <laughs> okay. I don't know about you, but I like the I'm going, taste I'm of going, anise <laughs> I'm in going, my cocktails. I'm going black licorice. Okay, that too. Stick with black licorice. If you're describing the drink, think black licorice. Not as, not as sour, right? Well, you're getting sour face on. <laughs> well, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> He's crying. <laughs> he loves it so much. He he can't contain himself. Oh, it's a mean one, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Am I, just I think if you're it? a fan of black licorice, this is your drink. Mm. <laughs> you know what it tastes like? Yes, black licorice. But <laughs> no, it but it, it but it tastes like carbonated little, black licorice. No, the little um. Well, yeah, but um, like the the black gumdrop. You know the the yeah. sugar coated black gumdrop yeah, ones. It's that's sweetness. exactly what it tastes like. It's got like. sweetness in there too because of the Midori. Lots of Midori. I hate right? those. <laughs> <laughs> you said you were all about this drink. I know. I liked it in principle. <laughs> so I like the idea of it. Yeah, it, it, it it's very contradictory it in like color. It looks like it'd be refreshing, but it's not oh. it is, refreshing. It is not refreshing. This drink is absinthe all over the place with a slight, subtle sweetness, right, which would really be... Like <laughs> it, Taste it. It's really that sugar that you're talking about, that sugar coating. Mm -hmm. It's all over yeah. there. So the sugar coating, oh, sugar coated black licorice, that's what you're going to get with this drink. That's exactly what you get. And everybody's going to have a different expression to, the, to, to how that drink tastes, most of which I'm getting... Not good. Um, you could soak those little candies in this. In the that would be cool. You can make you a could vodka out of that. <laughs> load them. Uh, so there you go. I, I, so you're not a, you're not a big fan? Slime boogers. Slime and boogers? Slime and boogers. <laughs> Black boogers. You know, obviously standing near a bonfire. With yeah, the... bonfire. That's right. <laughs> obviously. A bonfire. Yeah. Not a fan? <laughs> No. My brother does a lot. You get like. <laughs> if I want to get it back, you can show it at the end. Can no. I have that for a minute? This yeah, is what it looks like. Can have that back. I, like it. I like it. You like it? Yeah. See, if you like, if you're a fan of black licorice or absinthe, you're probably gonna find this a drink enjoyable with the added sweetness, which you don't often get from an absinthe because of the Midori. A little bit of melon. Really, the melon not being a big play. I don't think. No, it's no, really no. just bringing the sweetness with that black licorice. It needs something. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. EverydayDrinkers.tv. We're teaching you how to drink absinthe. And? You shouldn't do it one drink at a time. No. Not this one. One. Okay. One. one. Definitely one. one. Just one. Try it once. Twice? No. Why not? I don't think I need that. I don't think I need any of this. You're gonna take the one lime out. I don't know what it's for. Oh. Maybe you just drop it in the drink and it goes everywhere. <laughs> and that's the mean part of it. Well, I, I have no idea why it says one lime in there. I'm guessing one lime. That's to throw, throw it at somebody. Language.
and and a line. All right, to you're recording there. Oh, okay. Oh, ready? Okay. <laughs> 